Welcome to Kobo Products YouTube channel. Today, we're going to show you how to make a lipstick. The ingredients that generally make up a lipstick are pigments, emollients, waxes, microspheres, and film formers. We're starting off by weighing and adding in Kobo's SW dispersions. These are highly concentrated pigmentary dispersions of ITT treated pigments dispersed in high refractive index synthetic wax, which makes them perfectly compatible with our selected emollients and waxes. As a result, little amount of pigment is needed to achieve a vibrant and striking color. We mix the pigments until a uniform color is obtained, then we add to a beaker. Then we add emollients, which provides a soft texture and shine to the formula. Then we add our film former, CoboGuard 5400 CCT. This enhances adhesion to the skin. It also provides water resistance and stability of the film. It imparts gloss and helps suspend pigments. Mix thoroughly until homogeneous. We also add in a porous silica microsphere, MSS 500 3H. This helps prevent sweating of the stick and also provides an even color. We mix that until it's homogeneous. Now it's time to add the waxes. Waxes are a key ingredient to make the mold and the shape of the lipstick. They function as structuring agents providing rigidity and solidity. Along with other waxes, we included PM Wax 82 in the formula, which is a combination of waxes that gives structure. Once all the ingredients are mixed well and incorporated, it's time to move the mixture to a hot plate. Here, we add a probe to keep an eye on the temperature. Next, heat the mixture until it reaches a temperature of 90 degrees Celsius. At this point, the mixture is homogeneous and the waxes are completely melted. Now it's time to prepare the molds. To do so, apply a small amount of oil in the molds to ensure the stick is easily released from the mold. Once this is ready and the mixture is at 90 degrees Celsius, it's time to pour. Pour an uninterrupted stream to obtain an even and firm stick. It's okay to pour in a little excess amount because this can be cleaned up afterwards. Then we refrigerate the mold for 15 minutes to let the stick solidify. Once the time is up, the sticks are ready. Scrape off any excess from the top of the mold. Then we carefully remove the upper part of the mold to avoid breaking the sticks. Then a lipstick container is used to pull the stick out of the mold. And voila, look at how beautiful that looks. Our lipstick is ready to use.